In this video, we will introduce ball valves to explain how some ball valves work and some of the main components. First, we rotate the ball valve. You can see the ball valve on this side. Notice how the body is slightly larger here, since the sphere is here. The other side is symmetrical. Next, we look at some cross sections. This is an important component of the ball valve. Here we can see the ball valve is in the fully open position. If we play the button, you can directly see in the animation that at this point the valve closes and we've effectively stopped the traffic. Note that we only rotated the valve 90 degrees. So this type of valve is a quarter turn or 90 degree turn ball valve. You can see that the metal material looks like stainless steel, just like the body itself. The valve seat is made of soft material, which is some kind of elastic material, such as neoprene or hard rubber material which enables us to press the valve disc tightly. On the valve seat to get a good seal, we can see that the stem on the top of the ball valve connects into the groove on the top of the ball valve. This is what allows us to rotate the ball and open and close the valve. Note that the shape is rectangular. This allows us to increase the torque force without distorting the top of the ball valve. We have a large area for the stem to disc contact without the risk of rounding the top of the ball.